Hey everyone and welcome to the club. Today I'm going to be showing you how to draw Lionel Messi. Let's get started in the center of our page with the eyes. So we move over to the left side and draw in a circle. Starting from the very top, we'll work our way around to the bottom, and then back up towards the top. Now I'm going to leave a large gap in the center and draw the same thing on the right. So let's line up the top of the circle, and then come down to the same height, and back up to the top. Over on the top left of each eye, I'm going to draw a small circle for a highlight. So up against the edge, curve around, and back out. Let's line this up on the right side. Now we're going to go in and fill the outside area of the eyes in black. Now let's move up and draw on the brow. We're going to start on the left side. We're going to curve across over the eye and then down on the inside. Let's line this up on the right, curve up above the eye, and then out. Now we're going to curve the inside edge of the brow. Starting from the left, curve in and then up. Go to the right side and do the same thing. Now I just want to thicken up the eyebrow. Starting from the end, we're going to taper this so it gets a little bit thicker as we come in. Do the same thing on the right side. Curving out and then across. We're going to fill the eyebrows in black. Now we want to add a short curve in between the eyebrows. So we're going to leave a little gap on either side, draw a curve going up and then down. Now we're going to step in towards the center and draw on the nose. We're still on the left side, we're going to curve down in the middle and back up on the right. Now let's step down and draw on the mouth. We're going to start on the left side, we're going to curve up and then down. And then we'll step down again and draw a curve in the opposite direction, leaving a gap on the side, curve down and up for the lower lip. Now let's move to the side and draw on the lower part of the head. From the left eye, we're going to step out and draw a large half circle coming down in the middle. Now we're going to pull this back up on the right side, going out and then up. Let's add in the beard. From the left corner of the mouth, I'm going to curve down and in, and we'll pull that up on the left side of the lip. Let's do the same thing on the right side, curving down and then up. Now we're going to move back up to the corners of the nose, we curve out and then down just beside the corner of the mouth. And then from here, we're going to curve out and up towards the top of the cheek. Now we're gonna work our way up towards the top of the hairline. Starting from the left, we're gonna go up, curve that in towards the top. Do the same thing on the right, going up and then in. Now let's connect these two points with a curve, going up slightly in the middle and back down on the right. Now we're gonna draw on the side of the hair. Starting from the top of the cheek, we're gonna curve out and then in. Do the same thing on the right side, to the same height. Now we're going to draw the hair swept over towards the left side. So we're going to start on the left here, curve out and then down. Now from this point we want to curve up towards the top of the head and then just pull that down on the inside. So we're going to curve all the way up to the top, round this out and then pull that down. Let's layer the hair. Starting from the top here we're going to curve out and then down. Now we're going to step up again, we're going to curve out the side of the hair and pull that in on the right side. Let's add a little bit of texture to the hair. Starting from the center, curve up and out towards the left. We step over again and draw that once more. Let's tuck the ears along the side of the head. From the cheek, we're going to step up, curve up, round out the ear and we'll pull that in towards the side of the head. Let's line this up on the right side and do the same thing, curving around and then in. Let's add that curve inside the ear. Starting from the top of the cheek, we'll curve up and then out. 
Now that we complete the head, let's work our way down the body. We start with the sides of the body first. So over on the left side, we're gonna curve out and then down towards the hip. We're gonna do the same thing on the right side. Now let's close off the bottom. We're gonna start on the left side, we're gonna curve down and then back up on the right. Now we're gonna move up underneath the chin and draw on the collar. So starting on the left side, we're gonna draw a small half circle, curving down and then back up. Let's add the crest over on the right side. So we start along the top with a straight line. Now on the left side, I'm gonna curve down and in towards the middle. Go to the right, curve down towards that bottom point. Let's add some stripes to the jersey. Starting from the center, underneath the collar, we're gonna draw a straight line coming all the way down towards the waist. Now we're gonna move over towards the left side, draw another straight line coming down, and then we'll go to the right side. Now we're gonna go in behind the crest, and then continue along the bottom. Now we're gonna add one more set of stripes. Step out towards the left, underneath the head we'll curve out, and then down. And then on the right we're gonna go in behind the crest, and all the way down. Let's continue working our way down the legs. In the center, we're gonna step down, draw a curve from left to right, going up and then down. Now we're gonna leave a gap in the center, we're gonna move over towards the left, curve out and down towards the left heel, move over towards the right, curve out and down towards the right heel. Now let's round out the bottom of the feet. Starting from the left heel, we'll curve down and up towards the toe. We'll do the same thing on the right side. Now we're gonna round out the top of the foot. Starting from the left toe, we're gonna draw a half circle going up, aiming towards the heel. But we're not gonna go all the way. We're gonna stop right about there. We'll do the same thing on the right side. Now from the inside, we're gonna curve in the opposite direction. Curving down and then up towards the inside of the leg. Now we're gonna thicken up the sole. We're gonna take this curve, step up, and just duplicate that. Now directly below the lower torso, we're gonna draw the bottom edge of the shorts. So starting on the left side, we're gonna curve out and then up. Line this up on the right side and do the same thing. Now from the hips, we're gonna curve out and down towards the edge of the shorts. From the corner of the shorts, we're gonna step in, come straight down and then curve in towards the top of the foot. Now directly below the shorts, I'm going to curve down and up for the edge of the socks. Now we're going to add the number 10 on the left side of the shorts. So out here we're going to start with two straight lines side by side, close out the top with a straight line and the bottom with a straight line. Now with the zero we're going to draw an oval first and we'll draw a smaller oval on the inside. Now let's move up and draw on the arms. We start about halfway down the side of the body. So right here we're gonna curve out and down towards the wrist. Line this up on the right side and do the same thing. Now back on the left side, let's start with the thumb. Draw a small half circle, curving in and then back out. At the end of the thumb, we'll draw a bracket. Now at the bottom of the thumb, we're gonna curve down and up around that bracket. Let's add two more fingers. We're gonna step down down and up the second finger. Now the third finger, I'm gonna curve around, up, and pull that in underneath the head. Let's do the same thing on the right side. Starting with the thumb, and then that bracket. At the bottom of the thumb, we'll curve down and up around the bracket. Step down, curve up the second finger, and then the third finger is gonna go all the way around, and then in behind the head. Let's add the edge of the sleeve. Starting from the inside of the wrist, we'll curve down and up towards the outside of the arm on both sides. Now on the left arm, we're gonna add the crest. So we're gonna draw a small half circle, curving around and then back out. And the last thing we're gonna do is add the band across the right arm. So starting from the top of the inside edge of the arm, we're gonna curve up and then out. Draw this three more times, leave an even space gap in between. One more time. 
And that's pretty much it. There we have it. There's Lionel Messi. I hope you enjoyed today's lesson. Make sure you subscribe and send me your requests in the comments below. Thanks for watching and we'll see you again soon.